Hey guys, I'm Brittany Rivers and welcome to my channel. So today is going to be a Shopify video. I've been getting a lot of questions about Shopify, what apps I use, just a few tips and tricks I've learned on Shopify over this year. Um, let me go ahead and introduce myself. I am the owner of Casino Lashes. Make sure to follow us on Instagram at Casino Lashes. Visit our website, www.casinolashes. Follow me on Instagram at Madam Brittany. And let's go ahead and get into this video. Okay, guys. So I have my laptop here. I'm going to be opening it up and we're going to get on Shopify. So I'm a plant mom now. As you all can see, that is Roman. He's a little, he's in a little bit of a bad shape right now. So I'm trying to doctor him and stuff. Um, I actually have my window open. I don't usually do that, but now that I'm a mommy, I gotta have it open. A plant mom, don't, <laughs> I'm not a mommy, but y'all know. I am working on making the transition from Casino Lashes to Casino Cosmetics, which means my entrepreneur vlog is gonna almost have to start over because it literally feels like I'm starting a whole new business, trying to transform my lash company into cosmetics. So be on the lookout for a bunch of new entrepreneur blogs soon. Um, it's just something that's going to take me a while, but we're going to get this done because it was always the vision for it to be cosmetics. And I'm just ready to start looking at things, getting the ball rolling, etc., etc. I am a Shopify affiliate, so I have an affiliate link and I'll put it in the description box. So if you don't have your store with Shopify yet, you can use my affiliate link and get a free trial. So make sure you do that. So we have our apps up. I'm going to just like literally record my computer screen and show you all what apps I use, what they're for, etc., etc. So let's get this. Okay, so the first app I use is the Address Validator. So this kind of like when you're at checkout and someone's putting in their address, it's going to try to guess their address. If this thing cannot find it, it's going to kind of like tell me and alert me. And then sometimes I'll search it make sure it's a real address and it just makes it so easy so you aren't sending packages to the wrong address i'm not really using crazy rocket right now but that is a way to collect emails i've showed you all my dynamic banner suite so it's a few things from my first shopify video but not a lot so i guess we can go in and actually show you that my internet is a little slow so when i want a banner i could do so right now i don't have a banner on my site at all but I can make an announcement. So I did this. So when it's like a no code needed sale, I just put that. I can change the color over here, as you can see. Um, I also have a free shipping tab. So it's like free standard shipping on US orders and then the minimum order price. So it kind of like will add up their entire cost. So, okay, if you have $10 in your cart, it's gonna tell you, okay, you only need $15 to, um, get free shipping. So that's what that one does and the discount. So like I had a free shipping code, it tells them the discount code and that's basically what the banner looks on the top of my website. So let's go back. So Facebook, just when I connected to Facebook, it did that. Um, I do have form builder. So on my site, I actually have like an affiliate section. So they put in their information um, and it like they, I give them a code and everything and they get like if they get a bunch of referrals, they get a free pair of lashes. So that's what I use that for. Um, free persistent cart apps. So like um, sometimes like if you have a, I know Max do it, but if you'll get like a notification over there and it'll tell you like, um, it'll just pop up and say, you haven't checked out your order with Casino Lashes, blah, blah, blah. Free shipping bar is another thing like dynamic banner suite, but it's only for shipping. I don't really use it because um, I did not know Dynamic Banner Suite does all of that. Mega Menu. So let's head over to my site right quick. Here's my website. I feel like this looks really big. I didn't know these um, thingies look this big, but you see how I have 3D mink lashes. Oh, you see how that popped up about, it's a lot of parts here. So you see how this popped up about notifications? That's what I was telling you about the little thing they'll be in the corner, like over there on MacBooks. So I can allow that. So look, I'm going to allow notifications for Casino Lashes. And then here I will put in my email or you could just do, I don't feel lucky, but that's another app. I'll show you all in one second. But Mega Menu is like this little thing here. You see how I have this strip of all 
these things here. That's how I did that with Mega Menu. Multi-currency. So I do have um orders from everywhere, basically. So it'll be like from Norway, Canada, all countries. Um, so it will automatically convert the US dollars to um, whatever dollars, pounds, whatever the shopper is in. Next, we're on One Armed Bandit. So that's what I was just showing you all. You saw when I go to my website, it's not going to do it because of the way I have it set up. But when I went to my website and that little black game came up asking for the email, that's what that is. It's like a slot machine. And since we're casino themed, it makes sense to have that. Pirate ship. So this is the way I'm shipping now. Um, so I don't use Shopify ship anymore. So let me go here and show you all. I don't like ship straight from Shopify. This app is where I do all my shipping. One thing about them, like with Shopify, they put all your um, shipping labels on your bill for the end of the month. With Pirate Ship, you pay for those right then and there. So you'll be paying for your shipping labels before Shopify even like deposits the money sometimes into your account. Like you receive your payout. So um, that may be a downside, but you'll still get all that money later on from Shopify. And I do like that my bill isn't super high anymore. So Product Spinner, that's another game. Um, push out notifications, that is another notification thing I have. So if you just don't want to use the app right now, you can always disable it. You don't have to completely delete it. And um, I have Shopify email, of course. So that's like a free email thing I was trying out, but it has nothing on Sag Sagano, I guess. Email marketing. I love it. I love it. I love it. So let me give you all the tea on it. So I've been using Sun Sunguno, Sun Sunguno since the beginning of my store. Once you get to over 250 email subscribers, you have to start paying for the app. So I wanted to explore different emailing systems because I didn't want to have to pay $10 a month and I just didn't think that was important. But what I found was it's like so much easier with this app. It really is because you already have your template. It's so easy to change stuff. It's just an amazing app, you guys. It's easy to put in discounts. It can literally generate a discount for every single email subscriber. So if you want to only if you want a different discount for each person because like it's an email exclusive thing, you can do that with this. Um, so I definitely recommend it. I hate that I have to pay, but I went over the like two fifty, and then once you go over a thousand, you have to pay an extra ten dollars. I'm not exactly sure how much it is. I have like nine fifty right now, so I've been like cleaning out people trying to. Um, Make sure I stay under a thousand. Um, and this app actually will tell you your unsubscribe rate, how many people unsubscribe from your email, how many people opened it, how many people clicked on it. It tells you all of that. Um, your bounce rate, which means like the email wasn't the right email or something. So you know you should probably remove that email from your emailing list so you won't be over that thousand I was talking about. But yeah, this these are basically all of the apps I use on my store. I love these apps. Let me know if you have any apps that are just your go-to. Like I heard of Privy, but um, I just hate it. I really hate Privy. People just act like it's amazing and I just do not like it at all. Sometimes it's easier to have a bunch of apps that do different things instead of one big app that does, that not does, that does everything. I just find that to be way easier for me to understand. But I hope you all enjoyed this video. That is really all of the apps I use right now. I just love them. I love, love, love them. I wanted to put y'all on. This works for any kind of business you have, really. I hope you all enjoyed this video. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe. Follow me on Instagram at Brittany. Follow Casino Lashes. Check out my website and have a great day, you guys. Bye.